up everyone welcome to best car reviews i'm ben and today we'll be dissecting the 2024 cadillac celestic before we begin please like and subscribe so i can continue being accurate and clear car reviews in under 10 minutes let's get started the new flagship vehicle in cadillac's lineup is the celestic and it is poised to be an incredibly unique and technologically marvelous ev although not all information is known yet cadillac has still revealed a lot and it makes the anticipation for this vehicle even more so just seeing one of these on the road would be an experience if you're loving the design and want to know more, then stay tuned. Today we'll get the different trims and details that matter most to you to determine if this will be the best bang for your buck. Photos and information in today's video come direct from Cadillac or from Car and Driver. Let's get started. If you've seen my videos before, you know that these charts are usually filled with different trims, but this only has one. Uh, the Celestic will just be that, and it'll be very customizable to you uh, without different trim levels. Um, and by the way, if you go online, this says it could be pronounced Celestique or Celestic. I'm not positive, but I think it's Celestic. Uh, anyway, MSRP on this will start at $300,000. And as I alluded to right before, this is going to be a very customizable, customizable vehicle. And um, that will allow you to probably hike that price up quite significantly. But just starting at $300,000 is a very big number. And it will automatically kind of eliminate a lot of people from being able to get this. But if you can, it's going to be seriously cool. And we'll dive into more of what you can do later on. Uh, the engine for this, it'll be a dual electric motor setup, as this is an electric vehicle. And it'll give you 600 horsepower, 640 pound feet of torque. So no slouch at all when it comes from leaving the stoplight. You should be able to burn just about everybody. You get a one speed automatic transmission and drivetrain, you get all wheel drive, which is fantastic absolutely necessary and i think just about all scenarios especially if you're paying over three hundred thousand dollars you have to get all-wheel drive so glad to see that the range on this full charge is 300 miles uh, that is lacking compared to other ones in the class uh, so a little disappointing on that uh seems like you get a thousand dollars per mile of full charge if you want to break it down that way and that's not a lot take a look at the pictures now that have been released while we talk about it and some of the features this is obviously a very futuristic design and uh you know you can still fully be able to tell that it's a cadillac they've done well with it and also resembles the new lyric um like i said too this is going to be very customizable these will all be hand built by a select team of craftsmen uh, working for cadillac uh, they'll all be built to order and that will cause probably a limited number um, of orders that will be accepted because of that uh, one quick thing i want to say just Leave a comment if you think this thing actually kind of looks like a fancy hearse from the outside. I'm not actually thrilled with the body shape of this, um, but I do like the design other than that. Uh, but anyway, this is fast, but definitely lacking in the range compared to competitors. Like I mentioned, plenty for trips around town, but a long trip, it may not be enough. Uh, but one thing that I also said is good is the speed and you go zero to 60 in 3.8 seconds. That'll definitely add to the appeal and it'll definitely be able to put you in the back of your seat if you floor it. Uh, some of the design features here, you get some nice big wheels with a great design. Um, you get a very unique split taillight design there, kind of like a mirror design. Uh, this comes with standard adaptive air suspension. Uh, the rear wheel also has a steering feature to aid in sharp turns, as this is you know, a pretty long vehicle. There's no need to pick a best bang for your buck here since there aren't any trim levels. That best bang for your buck will be to customize however you want uh, if you find the money worth it. Just be prepared for that hefty price tag if you can even get in line to customize i have a feeling this is not going to be an easy car to get access to to even you know start to spec out yourself honestly with the information i have i'm currently not sure what makes this vehicle deserving of a three hundred thousand dollars starting price um, but perhaps as more information comes out it'll become more apparent uh, but given the information i know and what is also offered out there for this kind of money I would spend that 300000 elsewhere. I'm not really sure what is so special you're getting from this, uh, but maybe, you know, maybe we'll find out soon once it starts to get reviewed in person. Look at the interior now and the pictures that have been released of that, which is not many, but this is no doubt a stunning interior, fully customizable. You can have just about any wild color you want. Cadillac says there's no limit to how customizable it is, but obviously expect that price to probably go super high with the more you do. One seriously impressive and cool feature of this is you get 55 inches of screens spanning the dash composed of that digital gauge cluster and infotainment. 
that absolutely like annihilates the competitors when it comes to the amount of screen you get. And even the rear seat passengers each have a 12 and a half inch screen to themselves. Um, so no doubt this is just a TV with wheels. Um, each rider also gets a nice comfy bucket seat. The roof is made from an electrochromic glass panel that can be adjusted from transparent to opaque. It also allows for each of the four passengers to control their own section. Um, so, you know, if the driver wants a little more shaded, the guy in the back wants to fully see it through, you know, you can do that. And that's seriously cool technology. I like that a lot. You also get nice open pour wood accents, brushed metal and leather spanning the entirety of the inside, along with ambient interior lighting. You also get a superior 38 speaker AKG studio reference sound system with amplifiers and 3D surround sound. Blast any song you want, and it's going to feel like you're in the middle of that song. That's going to be a really cool system. And to top it all off, you get numerous driver's assist and safety features standard. In review, guys, the Celestic, Celestique, super cool car coming out from Cadillac. Little out of reach for most of us probably, but if you can get your hands on one, you know, you're going to have seemingly endless options to make this exactly how you want. And there's really not much on the market that's like that. The fact that these will be handcrafted specifically to you as built, you know, that's it's basically like you're designing your own car. And that's awesome. Uh, maybe this design will grow on me a little more, the body shape of it. But I think, you know, the light designs, the wheel designs, all that's top notch. And, uh, you know, I wouldn't say no to one of these if it was offered to me. But it'd be great to see that range number go up. For how much you're spending, why aren't you getting 500 miles or even 400 miles of range? Uh, it's definitely a knock on that. But other than that, you know, super cool, super unique. And this is the way cars are going. So Cadillac is uh, trying to stay ahead of the curve. Hopefully this video laid in the information down a clear way for you guys. Thank you for watching this Best Car Review. Please subscribe if not already. I'll catch you on the next Best Car Review.